morning, everyone. Welcome to Activities for People this Living really at Home with Dementia. We are proud to offer this series oh, of funding from the Area Agency on Aging and the United Way of Tarrant County. These programs are recorded and are made available for viewing through a YouTube channel for future use. I've gone back and looked at a few of these, and they're fun to rewatch, by the way. I bet. I am Martha Brown, your host for today's activities. We are presenting today Mind Fit with our favorite person, Will Frederick. Will, let's pump some neurons today. All right, let's do it. Okay, I need to oh, share screen. Here we go. <laughs> I always have to talk myself through it too. Okay, can you see it? Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, so I thought no better time than do the holiday edition. Absolutely. All right. And hopefully everything goes as planned. So uh, just this is just a recap of, of why we do these things. Just like the, the body can show age over time, so can the brain. And these are just activities to keep keep us, uh, as we grow older, keep us, our, our brains as sharp as they can be for as long as they can be. So each of these, we circle in on the five cognitive so, subdomains. And so today we'll go through all of them. We'll, we'll hit on all of them. Memory, executive function, attention, uh, language, and visual spatial perception. So those are, that's what we're gonna cover today. So we'll do some name that tune, but I will listen to lots of uh, holiday carols and try to guess what they are. But we have lots of different activities uh, intertwined between the name that tune. Okay. So uh, name that tune is pretty, pretty straightforward. You'll hear a holiday version of a song and uh, I'll provide some trivia questions to it as well. And we'll identify the song. Uh, so name that term tune exercises long term memory and benefits of music training expand beyond extend beyond musical skills and transfer to speech language emotion. If you're playing a tune, I can't hear it. No. You can't, okay. You can't hear it. Name that tune and it's not coming across. So, huh, how do I do this? I don't have a clue. <laughs> I wish I knew. Uh, let me look at more apps. Oh, Silent Night. That was Silent Night. Unfortunately, <laughs> we couldn't hear it. <laughs> but we didn't hear it, was it was really silent. <laughs> it was really silent, yeah. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Um, I have never done that, Will, and I'm sorry I don't know how to get that get that to do its thing. Yeah, I'm not sure I know either. That's true, but, you, but you're sharing your screen already. Yeah, I am. Uh, mute. Like... Will? Yeah. Um... If you click on the arrow besides the, the mute button, it comes out, it lets you select a microphone and the speakers. Does those look like they're set for what you have? Yeah. Oh, Speaker, God. headphone. Yeah. Audio settings, share screen. Huh. Uh, maybe I should. Sorry, uh, Martha, I should have sent this to you to make sure we could do it. No, well, we'll have to skip the, the audio, but there's lots of other things involved. Uh, so we'll just, uh, <laughs> my mistake, we'll, we'll learn from it. Well, Will, yeah. you can sing us the, the, the beginning of the tune. Yeah, yeah just hum, <laughs> just hum for us. Hum up for us, yeah. You're teaching us flexibility, Will. That's right, that's right. My humming skills aren't up to par. Let me, uh, we'll, so the first one was Silent Night. So here's a question about Silent Night. In what country did Silent Night originate? Germany. Germany. Austria. Austria. Yeah. And do you know what Austria. year in Austria? 1800 something. 
Oh, very good. Very good. 1816. Oh, Yay. oh wow. Oh, that's a lot of years that's ago. That's 200 years old. That is. Wow. Mm -hmm. It's around a long, long time. I'm impressed that Hans and Yetta knew Austria and all the rest of us guessed Germany. Yeah. Well, sorry. So right. can anybody no, complete uh, the lyrics from Silent Night? Silent Night, Holy Night, all is calm, all is bright, round John Virgin, mother and child, holy infant so tender and mild. Sleep in heavenly sleep. sleep. Sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. There you go. Sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. Yep. Okay. What is the most covered holiday song of all time? So we have four choices, Silent Night, White Christmas, Jingle Bells, and First Noel. Well, oh, so it's just, of cover, all time. Cover, cover oh. you mean uh, like the record or? Yeah, it, so it, every, it's. Every, everybody good. Yeah, everybody who's there. It's kind of like the go-to song for all the artists. What what one are they going to cover the most? White Christmas. White Christmas. White Christmas. White Christmas. White Christmas, is that our final answer? Yep. Silent Night. Oh, uh, well, yeah, it's about second. Silent Night, duh. <laughs> Jingle Bells and First Noel. Wow. <clears throat> Good to know. Uh -huh. Okay, so now a little family feud. Can you, top five answers are on the board. So can you name something you hang on a Christmas tree? Ornament. Ornament. Tinsel. Okay, ornaments oh. is number two. Tinsel. Okay. Tinsel's number four. Light. Light. And Light. Lights. Lights. Four. Lights is number one. Angel's number three, I heard. So we have one left. Star. No, not star. That's a good That's answer. Star. Though. You're kidding. Stockings? And it, they all right. Candy canes. Okay, there you go. Candy canes. Oh, oh go oh, Santa. Lights, <laughs> ornaments, angel, <coughs> pencil, and candy cane. Good okay. job. We got all those. Super. I'm afraid this might be a song. Oh no, okay, this is Unscramble the Holiday Song. So. Away in the Manger. Away yeah, in the Manger. Yeah. Very good, Away in the Manger. Yeah. Away in the Manger. Mm -hmm. Silent Night. Silent Night, yep. Okay. Silent Night. Mm -hmm. The French word Noel is often used around Christmas, but what was its original meaning in Latin? Oh. Mm, new? Close. No, no. Um, I, don't, I don't know any Latin names. Um, Peace. Peace. No. no. Is it, it an ounce? It's, it's close to new. It's a... Uh, Newborn renewal? Yeah, birth. 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 Okay. Oh. Birth. Ah. birth. I'll be. Okay. Okay. Sorry, we can't hear that. <laughs> but it's uh, this one's Jingle Bells. Okay. We know that. So here's a bonus question. What was Jingle Bells' original song name? Oh. Jingle Bells. Oh. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh, <laughs> we just heard that Jingle Bell. Uh, something about the sleigh. Uh, right dashing through the woods. Yeah. Whoever said the sleigh is correct. What part? That's Dusty. Dusty. Uh, uh, one heart open sleigh. I don't know. There you good. go. You got it. Yeah. What is that it? Was it? One horse open. Oh, sleigh. oh, okay. That was the original song name. Nice job, oh, Dusty. Yeah, I just read that the other day, and I remembered the sleigh part, but that was it. <laughs> uh, and then the other question was, Jingle Bells was actually written for what holiday? Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Yeah, there you go. Thanksgiving. I don't need that answer. <laughs> Thanksgiving. What was the first holiday song to mention Santa Claus? The house. Up, up on the up on the house top. Yeah. Probably. Yeah, if it's C, up on the housetop. Okay. Uh -huh. I don't even know that one. 
We don't. So the well, original Christmas carols years. were about the birth of Jesus. It wasn't until much, much later that Santa Claus entered into the equation. Up on the housetop was written by uh, Benjamin Hanby in 1864. The song mentioned Saint, Saint Nick, who is, of course, Santa Claus, making his first carol to mention, first, okay. making it the first carol to mention Santa. Wow. Mm. I thought it had something to do with a Coca Cola advertisement, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> it is the the outfit that's part of the coca-cola the round yeah the with the red outfit and the song frosty the snowman what made frosty come to life the hat the hat yeah oh good dusty dusty's on a roll I told dusty, you. Is, dusty is on a roll <laughs> And where would you find an old silk hat these days? <laughs> Goodwill. Well, yeah. where do you find snow? <laughs> yes. Can anybody complete the lyric, Frosty the Snowman? Frosty the Snowman was a jolly happy soul with a corn cob pipe, corn cob pipe and a button nose. And two eyes made out of coal. Oh. There Yay. you go. Oh, hey. Yeah. <laughs> and two eyes made out of coal. Yeah. You got it. That's seven words. <laughs> That's seven words. <laughs> Was it? Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we love you, Will. Six plus one. It's the same. Yeah, wow. yeah. Plus Best one is the next one. So this is four pictures, one word. So what what one word des would describe all four of those pictures? Christmas. Christmas? Christmas. Trio. Yeah, there you go. That's what yeah. we were looking yeah. for. Three. Tr trio. Trio. Oh, trio. Oh, okay. Oh. Christmas is a good one, too. I'll have to write that down. Yes. All right. Three. In the early 1800s, the first gingerbread house was reportedly inspired by what famous fairy tale? Absolutely. There you go, Hansel mm -hmm. and Gretel. These are too easy for you guys. <laughs> Dusty knows his stuff. Okay, this is another family feud. Name something that people usually do the day after Christmas. Return. Go shopping. Return. Exchanging gifts. Return gifts, yeah. Okay, return, return gifts. gifts is number one. Shopping is number two. Eat Eat left for the movies. Yeah, there you go. Eat leftovers, I heard, was three. Go to the movies was five. Eat leftovers. Yep, eat leftovers is there. And Philip Play said games. Philip said exercise. <laughs> well, the, the opposite of exercise. Sleep. Eat. Eat. Sleep. Play. Relax. Rest. Rest. <laughs> Rest. And play with gifts games. Okay. Yay. We Return got the gifts, game. shop, eat leftovers, play with gifts, go to the movies, and rest. Mm, okay. I wasn't sure if anybody did go to the movies after everything that's happened. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, it, well, it used to be. Yeah. Usually. That was a big time to go. Just watch Hallmark. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. right. So unscramble this holiday song. We... we... We, we three, three kings of Orient are. Orient are. There yes. they go. Bearing gifts, we traveled afar. Three kings, three kings of Orient are. Are. <laughs> Here. And then this one. The first the Noel. First Noel. Noel. Yeah. Yeah, that was too easy. <laughs> Okay. What is the most popular Christmas meal in Japan? Rice. Sushi. <laughs> Sushi. No, it, it's an American item. It's is American it fast food item. Duck? No. Turkey? Uh, no. No. Oh, hope, I'm starting to question this answer, but hopefully I'm on target. It's KFC. Oh, really? <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow, isn't that, that's okay. more people in the United States that have Chinese food on, 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 on Christmas. Yeah. Yes. Hmm, that's funny. 
KFC. <laughs> okay. This was a good one. Joy to the world. Okay. Who played George Bailey in the Christmas classic, It's a Wonderful Life? Jimmy Stewart. Stewart. Jimmy Stewart. Jimmy Stewart, B. That's right, Jimmy Stewart. Is a bell ringing? Mm -hmm. Who originally sang the song, White Christmas? Bing Crosby. Bing Crosby, yeah, Crosby. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> in holiday. Right. Bing Crosby. Yeah. Who are, who are Bing Crosby? Bonus question: Who wrote White Christmas? Irving Berlin. Yeah, that's good. Wow, go Don! I've watched I that know. movie so many times. I, sh I, 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 I remember that part. No, yeah. That's Irving Berlin. Buddy yeah, Brown. Irving Berlin. That's in your long-term memory, Don. Right? I guess so. Yeah. Yeah. yeah no that's up, say that up, he right. Remember, he talks about music. All those. People who wrote music. Yes, oh. we talked about yeah. right. Buddy Bray last Friday. Mm -hmm. True or false? Irving Berlin hated Elvis Presley's version of White Christmas so much that he tried to prevent radio stations from playing Presley's cover. I say true. Mm -hmm. It's probably true. I say true. True. Mm. So it. Uh, in 1957, yeah. Elvis recorded a Christmas album on it. He performed a song called Blue Christmas in addition to White Christmas. It was said Berlin couldn't stand Presley, and Presley recorded a cover version uh, that he was trying to, to get banned. Uh, he took it as sacrilege. So he and his members of his staff launched a furious campaign to try to get radio stations to ban it. Know that, Despite his efforts, Presley went to the top of the charts with it. Hmm. There's a trigger. That's a yeah. new one for me. What is it, Dusty? What was the only commercial that Elvis Presley ever did? Say that one more Santa time. Santa Claus Dusty's is coming. Dusty's talking. You better oh, not have that, I'm that, telling that, you why. Santa, Santa Claus is coming to town. Yeah. yeah. Okay. What? Uh, what? What's your answer, Dusty? I don't know. He's saying a jingle for a Southern Made Donut. I didn't know that. Southern Made either. Donuts. Oh my, is it on YouTube? <laughs> uh, Probably. I've never looked. <laughs> Santa Claus is coming. To I, I you better not. I missed a T there. <laughs> not cry. You did. Better not. And T is. I think you. somebody already said it. Yes. yes. Not pout, I'm telling you why. Oh, I didn't oh, say that. It, that was wrong. No, we didn't say that. Better not pout, I'm telling you why. No. Okay. Okay, we'll go to the next one. We'll get back on track. So four picks, one word. So what's the one word that could describe all four of these? Transportation. Yeah, yeah there you go. Oh. Modes oh. of transportation. That Modes. was quick. That's usually a hard one. That was fast. So again, another family feud. Top six answers are on the board. Name a word or phrase that begins with snow. Snowball. Snowflake. Snowball. Snowflake. Snow cone. Snowmobile. No angel. No angel. No man. skis. Snowman. No man. So we have snowflake is number one. Snowman's number two. Somebody said snowball is number three and Snow Angels number five. So we have two left. Right now. Snowfall. Yep, Snowfall's number six. Oh, word. <laughs> Snow ice cream. Oh, number good Number four. Oh. No cone? No, that's a good answer, but no, it didn't make the list. <laughs> this is a, a Snow famous Snow Disney Snow bells? Character. Disney Snow character. Disney. Snow White. Snow White. There you go. Snow White. Hmm. Oh, my word. <laughs> Snowflake, Snowman, Snowball, Snow White, Snow Angel, and Snowfall. Okay. Uh oh, sorry. That night. We <laughs> wish you a Merry Christmas. <laughs> and this is a bonus question from uh, We Wish You a Merry Christmas. In the third verse, what type of pudding is requested? 
Biggie. The biggie pudding. The biggie. Yeah. The figgy. Oh my word. <laughs> you bring it. Oh, bring us figgy pudding. Oh, bring us figgy figgy pudding. You got it. <laughs> Here's a quote from a movie. Uh, since the United States government declares this man to be Santa Claus, this court will not dispute it. Case dismissed. Something on 34th Street. Miracle yeah, on 34th, 34th Street. Street. You guys are good. I know. Miracle on 34th Street. Huh. Ah, that was the first Noel. Okay, this is a fun one. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. So uh, 1, 2, 3, 10, 11, and 12, those are front views of your Christmas tree. The ones in the middle, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, are the top views as you look down on the Christmas trees. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to match up the ones that were front facing to how they would look from the top. Oh. So, <laughs> seven is number one. Oh, wow. That's very good. Number one and seven. That's correct. Go, Steve. Uh, six is number three. No, six is, doesn't go with three. Really? Not two? No, six and two are not. Oh, okay. I think uh, we're wrong. Four, uh, tree two is number four. There you go. Two and oh, four. I was looking at the wrong tree. That's what I... <laughs> um, tree three is number five. Yeah, five number five. five. Yeah, there you go. <coughs> now we're just working on the bottom three. I uh, Number three is number five. How come there, there are no red bulbs? That's on? what I was going to say. Uh, because your upper, your the oh. upper ornaments are blocking them out. Okay. Ah. 10 is number. Eight. 12 is number nine. No. No. Eight. 10 is number nine. Yes. No. 10 and nine, yeah. 10 and Ten nine and go together. <laughs> So we have one and seven, two and four, three and five, and 10 and nine. So we're still on 11 and 12. Mm. Is number five been used yet? Yes, it was three and five. Okay. So 11 and 12 haven't been used and six and eight haven't been the top views of six and eight. So six. Six goes with what? 11. Yep, you're right. Nope, I'm right. You're right, yes, yes you're correct. And 11. 11, <laughs> 11 and six go together. Okay. So eight, just, eight has to be 12, then, right? That's right, 12 and eight. Wow. So you, That's you a your, tough one. Ooh, it is. It's easier if it's in front of you on, on paper and you can use kind of a, a pen, but it, that, that is a tough one. We have another tough one coming later, but these are fun. These are fun. I, I enjoy these. Yes. So one and seven, two and four, three and five, 10 and nine, 11 and six, and 12 and eight. So written in 1962, Do You Hear What I Hear has been recorded over 100 times by various artists and is firmly associated with the Christmas season. However, when it was first written, it was something else in mind. Oh, Buddy, first... Buddy Bray told us this. Who remembers? Cuban, the Cuban, Cuban Missile Crisis. That's right. Me. Go, Don. Yeah. Yeah. I remember Buddy said that. I remember Buddy said that. Yes. Yeah. So the husband and wife team wrote it as a prayer for peace. Mm -hmm. With a tail oh. as big as a kite, as it, I think that's supposed to be with a tail as big as a kite, isn't about the Star Spangled Banner. It's a missile. I need yeah. to check my spelling. Sorry about that. <laughs> All right. Join the group, hun. <laughs> 
So four picks, one word. Hat. Hat. Yeah, there you go, hats. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so can we complete the lyric of Winter Wonderland? Sleigh bell ring, <coughs> sleigh bell <laughs> rings. The cough too. Sleigh bell ring, sleigh bells ring. Are you listening? Listening. Are you listening? No. There you go. To the something is glistening. You are you listening? Yeah. The land. To the land is listening. Yep. In the lane. In the lane. That makes more sense. Snow is glistening. Oh. A beautiful sight. Walking in the winter wonderland. There you go. Mm -hmm. Top three answers. This is Family Feud. Name a holiday song with the word night in the title. Only three uh, are night. on the board. Night. 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 Number one. Yeah, that's number one. Uh, three. Okay, got two more. Uh, holy, oh, no. Oh, holy night? night. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, holy nights number two. Number two. Well, that was part of Simon. And this is when kids get the most excited. It's usually the night before Christmas. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think this is a song. Yeah. Yep. Silent night. <laughs> yeah. The, all these songs. That's great. They're called Simon. <laughs> okay. Little town Very quiet recordings. Name yeah. that tune. That was, uh, I'm getting myself all mixed up. That was a little town of Bethlehem. Okay. Four, this one's a little harder. Four picks, one word. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And it's really the little kid has the facial expressions. <laughs> Yeah. Facial expressions. Joy. Pardon? Joy. That's that's a good answer. It's not the one, but that could be joy. It's another happiness. Happiness. E e joy. Expectation. Happiness. Excitement. Those are all good. I, it's uh, I probably should have narrowed it down a bit. Uh, it's. It's um, trying to think of a good clue. The turkey throws us. Yeah, the turkey doesn't. Well, when you, when you everything's see, red. Everything has red in it. No, it's more of a word. It's um, prepared, ready. No, it's uh, delight. 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 Oh. oh, okay. Delight. So, how many times does Santa check his list? Twice. 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 Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, now can we complete the lyrics of Little Drummer Boy? Come, they told me, pa rum, pa pum, pum, and it's six words. A newborn came to see, pa rum, pa pum, pum. Yes, that's more than six words. <laughs> A newborn king, the king to see, pa rum, pa pum, pum. I don't know where I'm getting my, my uh, adding up here. <laughs> okay, you didn't a... count pa -rum -pum -pum -pum. You yeah, didn't yeah. count yeah. The... <laughs> This is another family feud. Name a holiday cartoon that plays on TV every year. The Christmas Rudolph. Story. Rudolph. Charlie Rudolph. Brown. Rudolph. Charlie Rudolph. Brown. Christmas Story? No, that uh, didn't make it. That's not really? That's not a cartoon. Oh, cartoon. Oh, cartoon. I'm sorry. Cartoon. Red Nose Reindeer. Rudolph, yep. Rudolph and Charlie Charlie Brown. Grinch, Grinch stole the Grinch. Yep, the Grinch. So uh, two left. Frosty the Snowman. Frosty the yeah, Snowman. There you go, Frosty. Ooh. That's the one with Burl Ives, isn't it? Yeah. Rudolph, Charlie Brown, Frosty, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, and one one's left. Somebody might have said it early on, and I didn't hear it. I I thought I might have heard it, but. What did you think you heard, Will? 
<laughs> Please tell me what you guys said. You <laughs> can't remember. <laughs> Santa Welcome Claus to is same. coming to town. Santa Claus is coming to town. Oh, I've not seen that one. <laughs> <laughs> this is another silent night. That was O Come All Ye Faithful. So this one's a challenging one. On the eleventh day of Christmas, my true love sent to me. Eleven, lords leaving. Eleven lords leaving. Sleeping? Is it? No, that's no, that's ten lords leaving. Okay. Nine, um, there's nine ladies. Nine ladies. That's ten, ten lords leaving. Eleven swans are swimming. Eleven swans, swans are swimming. No, 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 no. You know we can hit them all. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Process of elimination. Twelve. Twelve. What's twelve? Twelve <laughs> day of Christmas. I do. <laughs> Something with hot piping. Oh, piping. I, I heard it. Piper's piping. Yep. Oh, really? really? Oh, I said hot piping. Yeah. <laughs> I, I said piping. I got it from you. <laughs> Two turtle doves, three French hens, four calling birds, five golden rings, six geese of laying, seven swans of swimming, eight maids of milking, nine ladies dancing, ten lords of leaping, eleven pipers piping. And then 10, mm. 12, 12, oh, drum. 12, drums of drums. Drum, drum, drum. Did anybody ever have to memorize this for a school sing along? Yes. Uh, yes. Sure. Everything, up to, everything up to sixth grade. Uh-huh. <laughs> in 1951 movie Scrooge on what book? was based on what book? Christmas, Christmas Carol. Carol. There's a movie on uh I want to say maybe Netflix that tells how the Christmas Carol was made. Oh and really? How, how the author had writer's block and was about to lose everything and he was broke and it was how the, how Christmas Carol was was made. Uh, Charles Dickens. 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 Yeah, Charles Dickens. Yes. So four pictures, one word. Celebrate. Party. New Year. Yeah, New Year's Eve. <laughs> yeah, but none of them are at home watching Netflix in their jammies. Yeah. <laughs> Three words. <laughs> yeah. I don't quite make it to midnight. No. No. Okay, this is another fun one. So this is, can you find a mirror copy of every row? So uh, oh. one row goes this way and the exact same pattern goes back the other way. So it's they're mirroring each other. Oh. One and six? No. One and no. one and one four. And Yep, there you go. One and yeah, four. four. One, four, yeah. Two and six. Oh, there are more? Okay. No, two and not. Two and five. Two and five. Two and five. Then must be. So we have one and four, two and three. five. Three and six. Three and six. Wow. So that's another challenging one. <laughs> it is a challenging one. I didn't get it any of them. <laughs> Martha, I have to go. Okay, Nancy. Bye-bye, right. okay. Nancy. Bye, Bye Nancy. Bye, Nancy. Bye, Bye, Nancy. Bye. Bye, Nancy. How sweet of her to tell us. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Take it. That's nothing. Name that tune. So another another silent night. Hark the herald, Hark the herald angels, sing. angels sing. Here's a quote from a movie, movie. Strange, isn't it? Each man's life touches so many other lives. When he isn't around, he leaves an awful hole, doesn't he? Um, that's uh, uh, with Jack Stewart. Uh, yeah. Um, Clarence um, said that. Clarence. Wonderful life. It's a wonderful life. Wonderful yeah. Life. Yep. It's a wonderful life. I couldn't think of the name of the movie. It's a wonderful life. Yep. What was the original name of the movie Miracle on 34th Street? Macy's. Uh, Macy's. 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 No. 
Chris Kringle. Kringle. No. <laughs> Big Bart. That's right. <laughs> really? Really? So the, the, oh, according to Turner Classic Movies, George Seaton was lo who lobbied the, for the name The Big Heart. What huh. real life department store did Miracle on 34th Street Center on? Macy's. 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 Yeah. Can you complete the lyric? Let it snow. Oh, the weather outside is frightful. And the fire is so delightful. There you go. And since there's no place to go, let it snow. 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 <laughs> Such a choir. <laughs> yeah. So that was the song. It came upon a midnight clear. Okay. Okay, this one's hard to remember, so we'll see see how everybody does. Okay. Name the eight original reindeer reindeers. Prancer, Dancer, and, Dancer. and Prancer and Dixon and Comet and Kitch and Donald and Blitzen. You did it. That wasn't as hard as I thought. And Rudolph. Yeah. Rudolph. That was that was another that was another one I had to memorize. And Clyde. In elementary school. Blitzen, right, Comet, yeah. Cupid, Dasher, Prancer, Vixen, Dancer, and Donner. Wow. Who is the most famous reindeer of them all? Red, 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 red. The red-nosed reindeer. That's right. Here's a quote from a movie. Fog is thick as peanut butter. Fog is thick as peanut butter. Really? Uh, oh, uh, uh, um, elf. elf. No, no. No. Um. <laughs> you, you said it earlier, Don. Yes, you did. What did I say? <laughs> yeah, what is well, if I could remember, I'd tell you, baby. Um, it, it wasn't a cartoon. Okay. It was a oh, movie, so... but not a cartoon. Oh, Elf. No, not no. Elf, but, it, but no. it's on every year, multiple, multiple times. The Grinch. No. No. Oh, what did you say, Don? I said. Uh, did I say uh, a Christmas story? Yeah, nope. there you go. Oh, wait, yeah. no. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. I'm no. sorry. Oh. I got oh. ahead of myself. <laughs> oh. You belong, Will. You belong with us. That's right. Yes. This, this is was the cri Christmas story. Out, yeah. Christmas story. Christmas story. Yeah, Christmas story. With a BB gun. That's yeah. right. Red, red what red. child is is this? So uh, we'll go to the next one now. The Grinch is cuddly as a cactus. Oh. Yeah, that's right. Cuddly as a cactus. Okay. Really? Oh. <laughs> you're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. You are a real heel. You're cuddly as a cactus. You're as charming as an eel, Mr. Grinch. You're a bad banana with a greasy black peel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And anybody complete this? Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Something. Uh, okay. Is it Jack Frost nipping at your nose? Huh? Very yes. good. You yes, got it. it oh, very good. Jack Frost <laughs> nipping at your nose. We're sharp today. Good job, Phil. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what Christmas themed ballet premiered in St. Petersburg, Russia in 1892? Nutcracker. 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 There you go, the Nutcracker. What country created eggnog? Ooh. I don't know. I, I'm, I couldn't hear that. Huh? England. Yeah, very good. England. And what do most Europeans use for Christmas tree lights? Candles. 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 Yeah, that, I thought I'd get somebody. Nope. Real candles. Yeah, real candles. After red and green, what are the two most popular Christmas co colors? Silver and gold. Silver and gold, I got it on there. Sorry. <laughs> and where I was supposed to end with this. Okay. Uh oh. Well, you can't hear it. No. Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairy. Oh, yeah. That's it. That's it. All right. Oh, thank you. And, and another Yay. song is planned. Yay. Happy holidays. Well, happy holidays and thanks so much. Sorry, my music didn't work. That's okay. We I'll work on that to figure out how we do it. So name that tune's a fine one to do. 
Mm-hmm. That was. It is. So, uh, ha- happy holidays. Thank you. Thank you. Merry Christmas Merry and Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. Thank you, Will. Bye-bye. Bye, Bye. 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 Will. Bye. So long. Oh, Farewell. Yes. Well, let's take a look at what's coming up tomorrow. Okay. Let's do. Let's do. <laughs> Peggy Spear is bringing sleds. Oh, yeah. From the Eamon Carter Museum of American Art. Um, Gail will be with you tomorrow as your host. I'm taking a, uh, my Thanksgiving Friday tomorrow. Whoa. So Gail will be with you for Peggy Spear. And I'll be back oh. on Thursday for Nia moving to Heal. And then I'll, I'll, Paul Deemer on Friday. Or I'll be gone tomorrow. Okay. Be okay. okay. Thank so. you for letting us know, Steve. Well, who's on Friday? Sorry. I think Paul Deemer. Paul Deemer. Oh, okay. Okay. He's the young guy, right? Yes. Yeah. 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 He's so good. Yep. He's the one with the new baby, right? Yep. Yeah. I think so. I didn't yeah. know he had a baby. I knew he had was previous uh, newly wed. He's just newly wed. I don't think he has a baby. Oh, okay. Never mind. But that can't be. He can still have a new baby. That's true. That's right. Well, <laughs> let's hide and watch, and we'll find out on Friday. <laughs>